Wow, Apple is wasting no time at all, guys. Today we get iOS 11.4.1 Beta 1 to register developers. Now, remember yesterday, Apple released 11.4 with awesome new features, AirPlay 2, messages in the cloud, stereo pairing for HomePods, just a bunch of new features that were released yesterday. But Apple looks to be wanting to improve upon 11.4 in terms of stability and improvements with 11.4.1 Beta 1. It makes a lot of sense. Now, this one's for developers right now, public beta testers. I haven't seen this rollout to you yet. As always, we can expect this later tonight or tomorrow at the latest. Now, the software comes in at approximately 2 gigabytes. That's if you're updating from 11.4, okay? There's a few things I want to talk about with 11.4 yesterday. Additional follow-up information that I wanted to share with you guys. I'm not sure if you guys have ever seen this prompt here, but this one is a Wi-Fi warning. So if you disconnect from Wi-Fi while downloading a software... It would tell you that usage fees will apply. You can hit continue or cancel and it will let you do so. Now, Apple would never before this, Apple wouldn't let me download betas over the air without having to be connected to Wi-Fi. But yesterday, as I was updating from beta 6 to 11.4 final version, I got this prompt here telling me if I wanted to proceed with the data to download the firmware. So it's pretty interesting. First time I see this pop up here, let me know if you've received this pop up before as you walked away from your Wi-Fi connection. Now, there's an interesting uh, watch face the pride watch face which will most likely will be released on wwdc and there's a hack where you can change the date and i'll link down below to the original source that discovered this there's a watch face that's the pride one there and if you change the date to the 5th or the 4th of june when wwdc is held you can add the brand new watch face now i changed the date back and it disappeared and i tried redoing the hack in order to get the watch face here on the uh, new OS watch faces, but I can't get it to work again. What you would have to do is go to date and time here, change it to manual, and scroll all the way, let's say to the eighth or so, and go back to the watch faces. And it should show up here in this particular section here. The hack is no longer working, but again, you can see there that I did get it to work at one point on 11.4 yesterday. And there it is. So pretty cool stuff. A watch face that was discovered with a little hack. Uh, but other than that, there's really just not a whole lot going on with 11.4.1, guys. Just a minor software updates to improve on 11.4. And if I find anything additionally, of course, I'll be bringing that to you guys. I just wanted to share those few things with you guys. Keep in mind that I'm still testing 11.4 versus 11.3.1 in terms of battery performance those videos take time so should be out by tomorrow at the latest on friday okay guys so stay tuned here to the channel thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next one peace